Hey you guys, it's Palm Springs Cindy and it looks like I'm live and I am not going to be able to answer any comments because I can't see them. <laughs> but you guys can talk with one another. I am just um, sitting down and I'm having my coffee. And I'm getting ready. I'm getting my makeup and stuff on so I can get out and about today. And so I thought I would do this live. And um, it, live is so much easier because there is, uh, you know, no editing or, or anything involved. Hmm, I'm wondering if, okay, I'm just, I know my, um, my window light is not good, but that's okay. Hey, Marie Moore, I can see your name. Um, I got up this morning and um, I had a messy house. Just clothes strewn around in my closet that I needed to pick up and shoes that I've kicked off and needed to collect and put in my closet. And I, need, I needed to put my laundry in my dryer. And my husband is um, cleaning up out in the garage area. Woo, woo. <laughs> and so here I am. Um, I, ha I, I have a bunch of stuff to do today, but I thought you guys could join me in my bathroom while I started getting ready. Okay, my face was clean. I'm gonna put on this Laura Mercier uh, tinted moisturizer. And while I'm, while I'm doing this, I just feel like you guys are right in, in here with me. Um, this morning, Shelby, my little dog, got out. Um, and so, you know, I, and she didn't have her collar or anything on. So I went out and chased her. Oh, she loved it. She just ran further and further. Then she'd stop and she'd kind of like walk towards me. And then I'd go, Shelby, good girl, come see mommy. And then she turned around and ran away from me. It was like a little game for her. So um, she had her exercise this morning. I, and then I had to get in the car and uh, go follow her because um, I couldn't trace her fast enough. Okay, that's the Laura Mercier. It adds just a little tint. And let's see, what else? Oh, my birthday flowers. Um, I had to throw those away. They died. It's so sad to throw away birth or flowers of any kind, don't you think? I'm using this BB cream. It is a primer, and I like to put it on my eyes makes my eye makeup go on a little bit better because my eyes are old and they're crepey. Um, I did also want to talk about, while well, I'm having my coffee with you guys, um, I, I was checking my email and stuff this morning and I, I had got, I realized I had received a new sub whose name is Crimson Fantasy. And he's a young guy from, um, like, I want to say the UK, Mary Reed, you know about him. Well, anyway, he's a, uh, he's a musician, young musician. He's a friend of Gail's from Random Productions. So I listened to one of his songs, and it was pretty, it was pretty nice. And so I said, would you, would you, could I use one of your songs for an intro or exit to my videos? And he said, he, yes. So I, um, I listened, I, I listened like to the whole song and it was a really nice melody. It was kind of a soft rap kind of a thing, but um, I can't find my makeup that I'm looking for. Oh, here it is. But uh, the words were, you know, not really red hot for our community. I'm using my CC cream now, which, by the way, smells like Noxzema. I'm not crazy about that smell. 
you guys remember Noxzema. And so I said could to Crimson. He refers to himself as Crim. So I asked Crim if he would um, write a song for my channel that my channel was about mature women who are still beautiful and vital and wise and um, valuable to our society. And could he, you know, kind of like put words like that to his, to his song or, you know, to melody or whatever. So he, you know, I think he's gonna work on that. But anyway, for those of you who don't know, Crimson Fantasy, uh, go check his channel out because he's, um, he's a friend of Gail's from the um, Random Productions who, who we love. And, uh, okay, that's that. Now I'm gonna do my, start working on my eyes. And don't laugh, you guys, look at this horrible palette. But um, I've gotta get a new one. I think I might go to Ulta today. We'll see. Um, I'm spending so much money because of Thanksgiving and then I'm doing a little bit of eBay shopping online for my daughter for Christmas. And I, uh, you know, it all adds up. Do any of you guys ever, you know, you, you mean well, but you, you buy something here, something there, and then you're like, you're like thinking, or you check your bank statement and you're like thinking, yeah, that was, you know, I've, that's at starting to add up because with between, um, uh, you know, Thanksgiving food that you buy and all the little tchotchkes like candles and maybe some special Thanksgiving napkins and that extra bottle of wine that is a nicer brand than maybe you would normally um, buy for yourself. Um, that um, I truly, I want to say shout out to you guys, but I can't. So please don't get offended. <laughs> We're here just getting our makeup on this morning. Okay, I'm putting this light powder, one of these light powders. I like to put it right in here instead of shake that tart shape tape because the shape tape is pretty ooey gooey. And uh, by the way, I want to tell you guys, um, last week I had um, Botox and she put some Botox here and here. And, and so we're gonna see how, how that works, if it sort of pulls this up a tiny bit. She said it might. But you know, I got my second job, I got a job. So I, I've been, I was able to have that money to pay for my Botox. But there was a little bit of confusion in how much I was gonna get paid. So I, I don't have my job anymore. But I, like I said to the gal, no hard feelings. It's okay. So, because I do have a retirement after working 34 years as a teacher, now I'm going to put this warmth on because I, I was gonna use my little ring, but I think I'm okay without it. So, okay, another thing that, um, I need new patio. I have great patio furniture that I bought like at Sam's Club a long time ago. And it's a nice table, chairs, couch, two couches, one long, one short. Ooh, look at that. And um, I had, it came with no cushions. And so I needed cushions. And so I had, I went to a patio upholsterer and I bought, I had cushions made out of like this vinyl. It looks like marbled tannish. It's not real tan, it's, it's tan and brown, but it's, it looks like marble. It's really pretty. And so um, it's been so long, I need to get them redone. So I, I really can't afford to get it all done at once. So I'm starting with the chair cushions. My husband repadded and rebuilt the chair cushions 
but um, we need more fabric. So I'm gonna go today and see if I can find some patio fabric that mat that same vinyl. Hey, Gail! I just saw random productions, but truly I can't really see. <laughs> I can't see that good. <laughs> okay, and I also wanted to say that, you know what, we I've been wanting to be more aware of giving shout outs to our mature community. And um, and so I, I, I have a few uh, channels that I wanna, you know, give a shout out to soon as I find my, the right uh, brush that I'm looking for. Oh, please. Oh, it might be in here. Nope, it's not. Um, one of them is um, Pam Over 50 Beauty. She, I think she puts a video out, video out almost every day. She's absolutely darling. And she and I did a collab a while ago on California girls, because she lives in Northern California. But um, she, anyway, go visit Pam. She's darling. She, she really should have a lot more subscribers. Of course, every time I do this, everybody get that I give shout outs to zooms in subscribers, and then I'm the one lagging behind, but I don't care. So anyway, check out, you know, go visit Pam um, uh, Over 50 Beauty. I'm still looking for my brush. And I think I'm gonna have to break down. Oh, here it is. This is the little brush I like. And also, um, Life Over 60 with Sandra. Now, a lot of you do follow Sandra. Right now, I'm into this. Let me show you this color for my eyeshadow. A lot of you guys know who know Sandra. She uh, was the romper room teacher, and she has the most delightful videos. Very well produced. Nice music. Um, she takes you on trips with her, like on Saturday morning. She lives in Florida during the winter. Um, she's absolutely lovely, She and she's beautiful. And so she does... Um, she talks about fashion and she does fashion shows and in her in her house you know like i have my hallway fashion shows and so um sandra is a, is also channel worthy youtube worthy for you to go check her out you'll love her and she has a daughter brett who has a youtube channel and brett is a flight attendant and so she has, um, sometimes she takes you on some of her flight places and she talks about her job. And she too does, um, I, she too does uh, clothes, styles, she's, and she's darling. So anyway, she, Brett's channel, um, I think it's, I don't know the name of it, but if you go to, if you go to Life Over 60 with Sandra, she, she will, um, send you to Brett. I think she has a link to Brett's channels. Then, um, also, I want to talk about uh, Beauty on a Budget with Bella. Is Bella just the sweetest, dearest soul in the world? And so, Bella's really been uploading a lot lately, and she's been talking about some semi, well, not semi, some serious issues, which, you know, I enjoy because, you know, I do enjoy the, the makeup, hello, but, you know, I also enjoy the brain part of us, the uh, life circumstances and how we're dealing with them part of our community. So uh, Bella has been putting some uh, topics for discussion on um, her channel, not just makeup and stuff. And I've really enjoyed that. So, sorry you guys, I think my hand's in my way here. So anyway, check out uh, Beauty on a Budget with Bella. She's I, from England or the UK somewhere. She's got beautiful blonde hair and she's just the sweetest soul. And she has a My Story video that's very interesting. So everybody, you might wanna visit her. And 
I have eyelashes right here, but I don't have them over here. It's like they fell out and never came back. And let's see. I'm so glad you guys are here with me because, my, like I said, it's kind of quiet, a sa quiet Saturday morning. And then another one that I want, another uh, person I want to talk about is... Um, there's a gentleman that I have discovered. He's, he's actually my uh, hairdresser's husband. And they live, my hairdresser lives part-time here in the United States. And we live about an hour and a half or so from the Mexico border. But the husband and the kids live in Mexico. So their mission is to do charity work. They're like missionaries. And so his name is, he goes by... Um, Handy, handy Nando missionary. And he takes you around Mexico as he takes a small crew or meets a crew of men and women. And they do things like, they, they give, like this one video I watched, he put in a toilet for a family that's toilet had not worked and she has like a bazillion kids. And then he goes to like a, um, he went to an orphanage today's video is he went to an orphanage and saw these infants these newborns these babies and then he shows you around and then he does ask for prayer and um he doesn't really ask for money and doesn't really give up a, a site where you can give him money but it's very interesting to to watch him and his crew they're they're just it's a it's like a very honest fun look at what's going on in Mexico and how he and his friends are helping needy people. And, and you know, just to see their way of life. What is going on right here? And nobody's found my shoe or my um, eyebrow pencil yet. And I'm really hoping that you do. Because I need, I want to wear them. All right, now I have to go to the my sink to get this wet. I'll I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, here I am. All right, now I need eyeliner desperately, but I'm going to do the best I have with this. It's ID, whatever this is. And it's definitely really dark black. So, um, okay, another person, um, Bargains, Beauty, and More, Tracy. She is a new, fairly new channel. She has been very faithful about uploading. And I'm going to, I have to do this, this way. Very faithful about uploading. She does boxy charms and hauls and dollar store makeup. She really enjoys her um, nail polish colors. And she has a daughter who lives near me. And so we've been trying to get together, um, Bargains Beauty and more, and I. It has not worked out, but it will work out soon. It's got to. So I, I'm excited about that. And so check out Bargains Beauty and more. And once again, these are channels, YouTube channels that are growing and they, they just need a little advertising. And frankly, so does mine channel. So I like it that we have given each other shout outs. And I've been tapping in to the homeschooling community on Facebook. Somebody suggested that I go to Facebook because of my uh, brains, part of my channel like my how are you gifted or just smart how are you smart those kind of videos so i've enjoyed my homeschool friends because um you know they're home they're at home schooling their kids where we're more mature and our kids are pretty much grown well mine mine is Yes, I have a daughter who chooses to have me not talk about her. But I will say that I do have one daughter, and she's a teacher. 
and she teaches special needs children. She knows a lot about autistic children and, um, and special needs children in general. She's lovely, she's very smart, and she lives, she teaches here in, actually, she teaches in Rancho Mirage. But like I said, she chooses for me not to talk about her. That's really all I can say. And, um, okay, that's that. I'm gonna put the top of this back on. And, um, before I spill it. Okay, now I am going to do this. I'm, I'm gonna add a little more warmth to my face. I'm out of milk. I buy that almond milk. And uh, I keep forgetting to get it at the store. It's like I've been to the store, but I keep forgetting to get milk because I love my grape nut flakes in the morning. Okay, another channel that I want to give a shout out to, and they've, they have totally changed their channel and it really looks good, and that is Melinda's Life and Style. It used to be the Pigsty Atelier, that was the name of it, but now it's Melinda's Life and Style. She's, a, she's gorgeous, this long hair, and um, she uh, is redoing her house or something, I think, right now. And so, but she's still videotaping while she's doing it. My eyelashes need some help. So that's that. It's about 80 degree, 82 degrees out here today. So um, I don't know what I'm gonna wear to go putz around and do my errands today. Now I need my um, blush. And, you know, I don't know about so many of the ladies in the mature community, you know, they buy or they get all these palettes of makeup. And, and, I'm, and I'm just kind of not, I just kind of use up what I have and make it a little darker or a little lighter. But there is a couple palettes, there are a couple palettes I've seen that I have, uh, I thought, ooh, that's pretty. Okay, now, um, I am going to combine a few lipsticks. So here it goes. <laughs> this is my Tarte, or it's, not, it's my Ulta. And I decided I'm not a vegan anymore. But I am kind of, I am a vegetarian. But I'm only a vegetarian when it's, like if I'm someplace and I'm starving and they don't have anything vegetarian to offer me, then sometimes I can't be one. But I'm, I do try to stay away from, I, from the red meat, from, I don't, I'm trying to stay away from eggs, um, cheese, although I did, I have some cheese the other day on a burrito. Okay, I'm gonna mix this, this lipstick with it. This is a balm stain. I got this because I was out and about. And I didn't have, I forgot to bring my makeup and I needed lipstick like crazy. So, okay, that's that. And why in the world is this Tarte concealer called Shape Tape? I, where's the shape? And there's certainly no tape. So I, I'm, uh, if anybody can add or tell me why it's called Shape Tape, that'd be great. But I really do like it and I need it. Remember, I did that powder here, so I'm not going to do this down here. And um, I did talk to, when I got Botox, um, I talked to them about eye fillers under here. So I'm going to pursue that. But by the time I do all the stuff I want to do, I might as well just get a full facelift. 
probably be cheaper, but who knows? <laughs> okay, I can't resist. Where are my glasses? Cindy makes getting ready effortless. Oh yeah, right, Gail. <laughs> Gail, I, I'm, I'm cracking up about Crimson Fantasy. He is absolutely adorable. But I hope he can come up with a song that has to do with women. And because a lot of his songs have to do with heartache and, you know, and sad love. You know how those young kids are so passionate in their young age. All right, you guys, I think I'm about done. And it's time for me to do my hair, get rid of my little ponytail here. But uh, I'm going to finish my coffee. <laughs> and... It's been a pleasure. And I will um, I will see you guys later. Uh, I like going live even even if I can't answer your comments because I'm using my cell phone and there you know the font is like minus 10. but at least it, it's a fast and easy fun way to get a video up online in real time. And then I can go back and comment, make comments to your comments kind of a thing. So, oh gosh, look at everybody is, everybody is commenting and saying goodbye. I love it. I am going to try to, today when I'm out and about, I'm going to stop and get a veggie burger at one of my favorite places. I'm not going to Weight Watchers, as you guys know. It's just too hard for me to say no. I enjoy my food too much. And what else am I not doing? Um, I guess that's all. <laughs> um, you guys, I'm only human and I can set the bar and if I don't reach it, what am I gonna do? You know, I, I just, just the way it is. And at 67, I'm, I'm just um, trucking along in life, having fun. And so I wanna say thank you, YouTube community. Thank you all you wonderful, viewers and friends and uh, I love you guys and so until our next conversation bye bye oops I don't know how to stop it I guess I go like